Going to the market. Going to the market. Going to the market. Don't give me that crap. This is my spot. I paid for it, so it's mine. I'm the one who paid for this spot. Look, I've even got the permit for it. So stop lying to me and vamoose. Vamoose. Uh, may I ask what the problem is? Perhaps we can help in some way. No. Sadly, these two people are stupid. <laughs> Local, the merchant is wearing suits from the capital. Oh, yeah. class system. Class. <laughs> class war. Class war. Class war. Class war. <laughs> class war. Class war. Class war. Uh, thanks for the market are issued by the province's ruling lord. So for Seldic, that would be... This isn't good. You gotta stop him. Yo, fucking... <laughs> Who are you? Unhand me at once! I'm not sure exactly what's going on here, but violence isn't gonna solve anything. Unless you're me. I have a sword. <laughs> Shit, he does have a sword. Oh fuck, hers is way bigger! <laughs> Oh god, I'm still thinking about the fucking comment you made in the last recording. Which one was that? Oh, uh, I used my trained swordsman eye to know that they're both the same size, however they won't admit it. <laughs> yeah. It's just like, hold on, I'll be right. Yeah, I'm just watching a cutscene. Currently visiting this town on field study. And while we are not yet formal members of the army, I'm afraid we cannot simply walk by and ignore a fight in such a public place. A military academy? Oh, so there are a bunch of soldiers in training. What an Adios name is happening here? Oh, I thought that was Elliot. <laughs> Parker, one thing. I've just seen this hidden quest, so don't move. Wait, what? Oh, is there's hidden quests after this. Okay. <laughs> A man named Otto showing up. I've been fi filling, I've been filled in on what happened. Understood. Both of you permit for the same stall. Is that correct? Yeah. And both permits expire at the same time too. What is the meaning of this? I understand your concerns, but fighting over it is greatly inconveniencing the other customers. I'd be happy to discuss the matter in private, but I'll need you both to put your differences aside until it has been resolved. Okay. I guess. Well, that was a close one. Seems like every. Things gonna be fine now, though. Yeah, I guess the, he's the guy in charge. I really appreciate the four of you stepping in to defuse the situation. Though I suppose I should expect no less from the infamous Class 7 I've heard so infamous. Why would you say infamous? Infamous usually means bad. I mean, does infamous mean bad? I've always heard it in, like, a, a negative context, so I assumed infamous means bad. Alright, what you got going on, you loony? Oh, he has to take the other stall. Dang. It's a... It's a... Uh, a metaphor? I got back before the scene ended, so I'm good. Oh, cool. Indeed, Principal Van Dyke is an old friend of mine, you see. He asked me to personally select a few tasks that you might be able to complete. Well, that was nice of him. We appreciate your consideration as well. Yeah. All right. And the phone goes away now. Otherwise, I'm grateful to you for okay. taking such troublesome tasks off my hand. I can't thank you enough for the help at the market. If you hadn't been there, I imagine someone would have wound up getting hurt. I'm just glad we got there when we did. All right. Don't lend themselves to sharing space. Eventually, they agreed to compromise where they would each make use of the front stall on alternate weeks. 
Our stall we reserved is near the back of the market, however, so whoever's relegated there will likely see far lower for sale number. Better than nothing, I guess. It's like children whenever you're divorced. Every other week. <laughs> Every other week, you get the front stall. Yup. And the other parent will complain that no, they don't... No, it's my year to have it on Christmas. Yeah, exactly. And the other parent will complain they don't get to see the kid at... Uh, the other parent gets to see the kid more than than them, even though they get to see it the same fucking amount and cause more trouble than it's goddamn worth. Makes their I kid's life... I experienced that first hand. Makes the kid's life fucking miserable. Did we miss something? Wait, hold on. I, it, it literally sent me right here. Like, there was no, like, moving no, around. No, no. All right. Uh, I want you to see something, uh, and if not, we can just get it from the uh, pawn shop later, because we might have missed a chapter of Red Moon Rose. Damn it! We guess okay. We can buy it from the pawn shop later. I looked. I I I'll say. So I like to get measurements of like how long these playthroughs are gonna last. Um, so I just googled like Trails in the Sky Let's Play, and I looked through the uh, I looked through a couple playlists, and there was one playlist. That showed there are like what thirty chapters of Red Moon Rose. <laughs> it's a long book, yeah. Fuck. There's there's three chapters of Red Moon Rose to find in chapter one, for instance. We already found chapter one. Mm. We might have missed chapter two, and tomorrow oh. we can grab chapter three. Already. All right. Well. Uh, Provincial armies. We don't have to read it all, though. If you really don't. I would like. I mean, you you see, if you're if I'm going out of my way to get it, then I want to read it. Right. Well, we should we should get them. I think just because I think it's important for you to remember Red Moon Rose for later. I think what I'm going to do is instead of just reading them at the whenever we get them, I think I'll wait till we're about to end the session and then I will read them. Like, the end of the recording session, and then I'll read them. Right. Okay, you need to focus on your field studies. A new list of tasks for you tomorrow morning as well. You will? Oh boy, more tasks, alright. Hmm. See? Alright, yeah. Or it's still the 4th of the 24th. The 4th, 4th, 24th of the 4th? I don't, I don't know. You need to head back to the Grand Market. That's where the Hidden Quest and Red Moon Rose are. So. Sweet. Hmm, one of my rooms about the current head of it. I'll say I'll be here. Uh, there's a current head of Yusuf's dad, right? So we can ask Yusuf for some help here? Doubt there's anything he could do. Among the nobility, uh, decisions made by the head of the house are absolute, and since the Alberias are, represent one of the four great houses, the old, that old tradition is absolutely guaranteed to be alive and well. Hmm. No, oh, is it Sarah? Hey! What's up, girl? I've been getting absolutely wasted today. Uh, yeah. Figured it was about time to get going. Group B's not getting anything done as expected, so I'm off to help sort them out. What? You're going to go see Group B now? The town of Parma is a considerable distance from here. Now, now, you let me worry about that. You four are perfectly capable of looking after yourselves anyway, right? Put your heads together and think. Put your heads together and think, and I'm certain you'll see what you need to do. Ah. Toodaloo! Oh, audio. Adidos. Uh, Idios? Adios. Adios, okay. The goddess is named Adios. Gotcha. Alright. An early dinner seems wise. Fuck that! <laughs> All right, go to the market. To the grand market, yeah. 
If she's still there, talk to Anita in the southeast of the Grand Market. Somebody named Anita. She should give you Red Moon Rose Chapter 2. Northeast, southwest. She should be around here. Probably the girl in red. Can't talk to her. Okay. You. There you go. Thank you. All right, where's the hidden quest? Now talk to the guy. Uh, it's somebody named Lyman. He should be the guy. I think his name. I think Lyman was the guy who had the uh, uh, who had like the accent. I think that was him. Okay. Oh, the Scotsman. Hey, man. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah. All right, troops. What? Uh, what? Fuck? <laughs> what is your accent supposed? To I don't give a shit. What? Are you give me your quest. Tired after all your hard work today. Fancy a wee bit of run into the store for a bit. Sure. Ah, oh, it's fine. A lot of work's about to have the skills to negotiate well, and it'll become good experience for y'all. How about it? Really interesting proposal. Hmm. What you got? Good to hear. Let's get started right away then. Mentioned that I was about to get, to get started on the evening sale, didn't I? I might be a wee bit though, but I'd like you to get to handle it. Sounds kind of rough. Am I? So what up? So all you need to do is give appropriate discounts to make a sale. Wait. Wait. What am I? Am I about to help run a stall? Yeah, I'll tell you which choices to make. Oh god. To, to get the max AP. Thank you. Don't worry. You're welcome. I got I got the game facts up for you, buddy. Hell yeah. The more happy customers you've got, and I, and if you've got more than cust ugh, more and more customers walking away happy, then your store is gonna have a good reputation. All right, all right, all right. There's no harm in competing with each other, is there? Think of each other as rivals and try as hard as you can to win. I don't know about you guys, but sales aren't exactly my forte. Guess I'll be taking it as a learning experience. It does sound like it'll be fun, though. I don't fucking care what you think will be fun. <laughs> okay. All right, when it comes to getting discounts. God, they are talking a lot about giving a discount. Discounts, 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 discounts. Fresh goods can be sold for as much as 50% off, while processed goods can only be sold for 20% off. Got it. I remember that. I don't be shy to bump prices up a wee bit either. Depending on the it's time. I I feel like we're about to get the ramen cooking mini game from Yakuza 5. What the fuck? <laughs> don't worry. I'll tell you what, what choices to pick. You'll be fine. So does everyone... Does, did, oh. Oh wait. Reen's Re just standing there. We're currently in the middle of our evening sale! I have zero faith in him. <laughs> Don't worry about it. I have zero faith too. <laughs> I'd rather worry myself. He's the main character. I'm sure we'll be fine. Huh? Are you working here part-time? I almost thought you were a pro with a voice like that. Oh, thank you! By the way, do you have any tomatoes? Hmm. Five should do for Fucking now. tomatoes, but yeah, I have some. So how much would that end up being? Hmm. It's ten mirror per tomato. I can give her half off because they're fresh goods. So, ten mirror per tomato. Thirty-five. Thirty-five. So because it's fifty, half is thirty-five. How does that sound? Hmm. That sounds fine. I'll take them. Thank you for your purchase. Indeed, he appears you didn't give her the full half off. Oh. You know. But that's not a full half off? Okay. Oh, he's a tourist. Jack up the prices horribly. Nine hundred. Nine hundred. Uh. Ooh. Uh. uh Include some cheese for 20% off. I see. 
Oh, that sounds like an interesting offer. Cheese and companies wide rather well, to Allow me to take you up on that? Thank you for your purchase. That went pretty well. Now there's accessories. Have you ever had? Never mind, you don't drink. Oh. No, I mean, even... I actually have t tasted wine. And I hate it. <laughs> it's gross. Taste, I, it, cheese actually makes it bearable. I don't like wine that much either. No, any, oh, it's the girl I stole that book from. What happened to Lyman? Who would just look over and, the, and look right behind you and, oh, hey, he's right over fucking there. How much are you selling he's cabbages? Dead. I need three, but she told me to buy some extra if they're cheap. Hmm. It's 20 mirror per cabbage if they fall in her fresh goods, so. Oh, God, fuck me. All right. Okay. Sell six for 60 mirror. Six. Sell six for 60 mirror. Okay. How does six for the same price sound good? Uh, so I get double the amount for free? I'm sure my mom will be happy to hear that. Can I have them then? Of course. Thank you for your purchase. I wouldn't fuck over this kid. That would be rude. And thus Reen's turn came you to an end. full half off. Yeah. yeah. Alright. Alright, you had your turns then. Good job, troops. Alright. Did it. It's pretty interesting showing how your personalities affected your results, too. Speaking of which, how do we all do in the end? Well, you had the least amount of sales out of everyone, Elliot, because you fucking suck. No one likes you. So that also means you didn't really offer that much of a discount. You have to be more aggressive, really. Ah, uh, ha, 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 sorry about that. I hope you get bullied when you get back to school. You are a wee bit too generous with the discount. Making a lot of sales is good, but you still have to consider how much you're making from them. I just said my thanks for the advice. Looks up screen. Wait, what? Oh, can you not be Elisa? Is Elisa always going to be the best? Yes. Or Alyssa? Hmm. Yeah, you can't beat Elisa. Damn. I kind of want to see the outcome of you do the worst. Just curious. Coral bracelet. <laughs> Marble bracelet. Right, he said I, he would give me money, but he gave me a bracelet? Two bracelets. Arts plus five prevents mute. A luxurious bracelet set more Ooh. Will we need to worry about blind anytime soon? Not, I don't think you will re for a little bit. I'm gonna give this to her, and I'll give you the arts one because you need it. Armor break is too useful to lose. Anyway, that's it. Is that it for today? Right. Yep. Uh, yeah, you head back to return to the end for dinner for the day. Sweet. Oh, sketchy man. Oh, no, that's the guy who settled the dispute. Nice. We did good. It's a oh. good day of work, Parker. Oh, that was delicious. It was. Those some seriously fresh vegetables. Too. All those vegetables we had. Our some plates are still. Acting, all these, all these, all these plates left on the table. We ate so much, and now we have overly large cups of coffee. Yeah, nothing beats food made from local ingredients. I quite enjoyed the rye bread myself. A fucking, of course you eat rye bread. I suppose this whole field study thing isn't so bad when you take the menu into account. <laughs> I wonder what the others in Group B are doing right now. Flash cut the fruit, Group B. Eat the rich, eat the rich, eat the rich. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck Gaius you. is just in the back smoking and the other two who I forget are with them are just like, God, I want to die. <laughs> Somehow I doubt they're sitting around a table and talking like He's we like, are. Listen, 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 Maki, it's useless. Just have some weed. Just, 
Bro, just try, try this shit out. It's <sighs> fucking lighting your souls, dude. Who's left then? It's Emma and. I can't help but question what missing? exactly Class Seven's purpose is, though. Who? Fee, yeah. Hey. Fee already Fee smokes. Without a class. doubt. I think that's the only reason we've been. Fee, oh, she's the guy. Like, this is some shit, man. <laughs> no, she doesn't even. Well, she doesn't say full I'm sentences. She just go like, yeah. <laughs> if that were all, today's field study tasks <laughs> would serve little purpose. It seems as though she's trying to make us experience. I don't know. Things. Like all kinds of things, big and small. What I can't wrap my head around, though, is why. Yeah. Hmm. Instead of oh, fuck. To put everything in its place, why don't you just go with the flow for a change? Wow. Does my phone really look that stupid? God, my face is so dumb. It seems like you're desperately trying to find something. Huh. Every time I look in the mirror in the morning, it's just... Dis uh, every time I look in the mirror, it's just disappointment. <laughs> what do we have to offer one another? Oh, but our reasons for enrolling in Thor's in the first place are undoubtedly very different. No, I mean, I. What if it's just like Finland? You have to enroll in in a military academy at some point. Our reasons? I hadn't considered that. My reason for enrolling was quite simple. I want to beat the shit out of people. To my goal. Or, rather, to the person whom I regard as such. Who is that? <laughs> this is neither the time nor the place to discuss such matters. Best to save that topic for another day. Uh, what about you, Elisa? Why did you enroll at the Academy? It's probably Papa. Papa. Hmm. The Radiant Blade Master. There's no one single reason, but... Holy shit, we've been recording for two hours. It sure as hell has not felt like it. <laughs> My situation back at home isn't exactly ideal, and this seems like this a game good way to get out you. and do more, I guess. <laughs> well, my mom drinks and my dad abuses me, so why not join the military? I see. Hmm. It sounds like I'm probably in the minority. Or place to get out that frustration. See, I wasn't intending on coming here at all originally. I wanted to do something completely different. You did? Oh yeah. You said you were really hoping you'd get into a music academy, right? Oh? <laughs> well, I wasn't that serious about it or anything. What about you, Reen? You're the last holdout, and since you're the one who brought it up, it's only fair you answer the question, I too. I mean, yeah, and also you've been all kind of sneaky about your reasons for literally anything okay. in this game. Hmm. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we'll get the flashback chapter How at some you point. Myself, I guess. <laughs> find yourself? Huh? <laughs> Sorry. That makes it sound like a much bigger deal than it actually is. That's the best way I can think of to put it, though. Mm. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. Going on a journey of self-discovery? It's actually a pretty cool answer. Wow, you're so cool, Ring! Ha 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 ha! Please be my friend! <laughs> yeah, I had no idea you were such a romantic. I'll think about it, Elliot. You sure don't come across as one. Thank you. Uh, Romanticist? That's a weird way to put it. How, why did you breathe like that? that That's not a sigh. That's a... <laughs> type of breathing. <sighs> but we're not actually going to sleep yet, are we? until we write our reports for the day. I want to shut off my brain so badly right now, but it doesn't look like that's happening anytime soon. <laughs> she seems to have forgotten all about the room situation, and I'm not about to remind her. Ten minutes. I give it ten minutes. Reen? Yes? I wasn't sure whether to ask or not. But I've decided that this question bears answering. <laughs> Why have you chosen to hold back? Oh. Uh. What? Your sword style and technique. Oh, it we're going to talk about that. It is Blade School, is it not? <sighs> Popularized by the sword hermit, Yun Kafai, it combines the best elements of other Eastern sword styles. Those who master any of its forms are referred to as a divine blade. 
and are said hmm. to understand the true nature of all things. So just mastering one makes you just the ultimate badass. What if you master all of them? The, it, it, I told you in your Yunka Fi. It's the bad motherfucker style, I told you. Well, if you master all of them, do you just become an immortal god? Like, what the fuck? I, I don't know, man. No Cassius Bright only mastered it. one. Huh. I didn't think it was particularly renowned here in the well, Empire. Well, which, which one of the leaves does Reen master? Of the Arsaid school consider the study of other sorts and called Seal 4. Go! What?! <laughs> in addition, my father was <laughs> Are you is are you fucking joking or not? If you follow the path of the sword, I'm not joking. It is only a matter of oh time God. before you encounter a follower of the eight leaves. Your father said that? <laughs> it's an honor to be acknowledged by the radiant blade master himself. He didn't acknowledge you. He just acknowledged the style. Nothing special though. No. I'm just a dropout who's never even been able to progress past beginner level. I did train under Master Ka Fai for a while. But I started to feel like I couldn't go any further with my abilities, and he cut my training short. Uh. What? So I'm really not holding back. Honest. I actually kind of feel like I'm dirtying the good name of the Eight Leaf School, in fact. But this is my limit. I'm sorry I can't quite live up to your expectations. <sighs> she did that gasp again! That's not a gasp! Laura? Oh, you she... have no reason to apologize to me. This is a matter you must come to terms with. You have disrespected me and my family. <laughs> Though I'll admit to some disappointment. Damn. I was hoping you'd prove to be a good sparring partner. Wow, get roasted. I... I'm going to practice outside for a bit. Please go and finish your report with Elisa and Elliot. You scrub. Go finish your report like a normal person, not one who knows how to be cool with a sword like me. Wow, Ring got doesn't want to talk fucking about hardcore roasted. I can see in his eyes sometimes that he's bottling something up and trying really hard to keep anyone else from noticing. And Elliot's just here, I guess. You've noticed it too? No, they're whispering again. God fucking... Sure, have taken quite an interest in it. whisper, Parker. It's not though. I, I was it's just not even to work close. Out time to apologize. That's all. It's not close to whispering. It's not like I've been consciously paying attention to him or anything. Honestly, you have. <laughs> Don't lie Reen's to me. He's not the only one bottling up his feelings, though, is he? You've been doing the same thing. I. Yeah, I guess I have. Ugh. Look at Elliot being a cool dude. This is the writing the report music. I'll shit talk Elliot throughout this whole playthrough, but he's great. Oh, okay, cool. Do we get B5? Please run me someday. Yeah! <laughs> I, got, I got Sarah to say things. Picks are on me someday. Yeah. Cool. Hey, listen, in Cold Steel 3, I will fucking take it. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we got. Assigned a task. Oh, both are unrequired. Okay. So I found a wallet on the floor in front of my stall. Would someone be willing to find its owner for me? I See me at my ceramic stall and I'll tell you more. A large versus monster has been stolen on West Celtic Highway. I'd be happier if someone took it out. Zordar is the monster. I thought that was the name of the person who asked that. Stone bridge leading to the Heimdall, leading to Heimdall on the West Celtic Highway. Hmm. Okay, shall we get started, man? Yup. Hey, Laura, I want to apologize for what I said to you yesterday evening. Oh, uh, Green? As I told you then, it doesn't matter you must come to terms with on your own. It is not something I wish to wish an apo uh, for which an apology is required. What? 
What I said about being a dropout has never been the president <laughs> was disrespectful. One of the reasons I felt like it was inappropriate to say what I said, so I'm sorry. If that's the case, then there is one other person you should be apologizing to as well. Uh huh. God, she is like honor bound to the fucking bone, huh? Yeah, and she's great. This is part of life, an inseparable part of who I am. I see. God, we're gonna sword fuck so hard. <laughs> <laughs> Right after the rainfall, so to speak. Class C girl says, "What else could Margo, we got. I, two. I appreciate how succinctly that was that was uh, fixed. Yeah. Oh shit! Uh, slow down, Luis. First thing in the morning, you're about to get, you're about poised to wake the dead. When you been? You're late. All right, what's up? Big, big trouble. Something terrible happened over at the market. Hmm. Oh shit! Main quest! We might as well go take a look. All right, let's take a slight detour and see what's happening at the market then. Do we need to go do that first, or do we need to do the optional quest first? Uh, no, do that first, and then before you move on with that, after you go, do the optional stuff. Cool. Let me walk there. Why are you still playing your fucking fiddle? One of them fiddle? is. <laughs> I like it. It's totally different. My arm kind of hurts, but I can't really stop. It's the only thing my brain is capable of. This is the only idol animation I was given. Yeah, I don't. I swear to God, is it? God it's... made me with this fiddle. God made me this way, and now I am cursed. Is it the same two people from yesterday? Yeah, it's the same fuckers. God damn it. Both stalls were destroyed. Why are they arguing? Yes. Hmm. I see. This is a predicament that we must solve with the power of Class 7 warfare. Bring out the nukes. Let's do this. Listen. I'll destroy all the stalls if I have to. <laughs> I'll bring them. I'll just fucking... I will go Scorched Earth, motherfucker. Alright, where's the third chapter of Red Moon Rose, by the way? It, where do we get it? Uh, it's, uh... It's on the West High... It's at the West Highway Farmhouse. Somebody named Robin. Oh, fuck. You have to go to the West Highway for a monster anyway. I know that. So are we going to be going to Parm at some point, or is that just like the place where B-Team is at right now and they're fucking... Old Steel 3. Oh my god! 
It all comes back around. Yeah. Yeah, so basically, uh, in this game, you mostly explore the eastern half of the Empire. And in Cold Steel 3 and 4, you mostly go through the western half of the Empire. Okay. I'm guessing 2 is mostly set in the east as well? Yes. Mm. Uh huh. Just trying to force both merchants to. Whoa! Yeah, something about this seems kind of wrong. Yeah, this is this isn't right. Hold on. This is I smell a whiff of bullshit. I'm a busy man with more important things to deal with than your dumb ass. All right, fuck all of y'all. Goodbye. <laughs> Huh. So the province army doesn't give a shit. They're just like, stop arguing. Yeah. Huh. Do you know why the provincial army doesn't give a shit? Because they're the pr provincial army? And this isn't... No, but be it, it's because uh, it's because the market and Lord Alborea aren't getting along right now. Ah. I'm guessing they're about to explain that right here. I believe so, yeah. Merchant Saul says livelihood. Any action taken apart? Yeah, you think and throw him into blind rage? And it's hard to bring someone back from that. I mean, understandable. They literally just got all of their stuff stolen. Yeah. Well, it's difficult to believe they make an attempt to find an amicable solution. We have no intent of trying to resolve any issues involving the market. And I can't see that changing unless we decide to just accept the sales task. Oh, god damn it! Hmm. <laughs> Oh, Reen, what's your, what's your thought? Hmm. We're not students trained for the military. No, we're students trained for the military. We can't just stand by and allow something so unjust to go unchallenged. Well... I hate to break it to you, pal, but I believe you're joining the military. That's kind of the M.O. <laughs> Is that too political? Did I just get too political? I don't know, man. It's exactly like the sort of thing she meant. At least it does to me. Why do they have their portraits up if we can see their face very clearly? I don't know. Hmm. Probably a leftover from the Vita. They did that probably so you can see their expressions better. But since, you know, this is on my yeah. high resolution monitor, uh, I'm pretty. I can see it pretty well. Okay. Yeah. Remember, I'm responsible for your safety. If anything were to happen to you, I couldn't even look Van Dyke in the eye anymore. Be careful, we promise. I know I will, at least. I probably need to be more careful than anyone else here. Alright, time to get this investigation started by ignoring this investigation and doing the quest we were given. Whose wallet's lost, you said? The starting point would be the Grand Market itself, the scene of the crime. Can't argue with that. This is some crime-solving music. I'm having Mishi Bob along to it. 
I swear to God, if we are actually on a time limit, I'm gonna fucking lose it. No? Good. We are. Okay. Okay. West Celtic Highways Monster and a Lost Wallet. Uh, f go to Lizzie at the ceramic stall. Let's do that first and then let's go kill that monster. You're the ceramics? You look like ceramics. Excuse me, what happened to Lizzie? Let's make you the students from Thor's who market managers ever coming, eh? Is there any hidden quests, by the way? I gotta keep asking that just so you, you can make sure to check. No, not today, I believe. Uh, there is there is any the more? Is there any more for chapter one? No. Other than that chapter of Red Moon Rose, and that's it. Oh, great. Like a lot of Mira. This isn't a, just a chump of change we're talking about. The only thing other was a train ticket to Heimdall that's scheduled for tomorrow. Huh. I, yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Just go back to the train station and ask who bought this ticket if they can even do that. This is the well, I imagine the person came around searching for it, so you can ask. Yes, there was an inquiry. Well, it seemed to match the description we received, too. I believe it was this morning. A young lady came in a panic, claiming that she was a complete loss without her wallet and its content. Traveling alone, too. I swear to God, if it ends up being Sarah. <laughs> it's not Sarah. Oh. Into the, to do a thorough check, if I recall correctly. It's the Weathercock, right? Oh, that's an unfortunate name. You've been staying there yourself. I know. I I know. I, I thought I saw it on literally the front of the building. And I was like, no, that couldn't be it. <laughs> and then he said it, and now I'm like, Don't oh. Don't say Weathercock. Well, Weathercock is what you, what those um, things that tell the direction of the weather that have a little chicken on them. That's what those are. They're called, they used to be called yeah, Weathercocks. Yeah. Now they're called something else that I don't remember the name of. Because they didn't want to call them Weathercocks anymore. I get it. Yeah. Because cock isn't really something you can just say now. You know, all the time people would just cock. call chickens cocks. But now they mean something different in the zeitgeist of social culture. What the fuck did she just say? Hold on. <laughs> I, didn't hear, I didn't catch any of that. Oh. Uh. Crap. Hold on, let me you just... You can check in the, uh, the notebook. Oh, that's what I assumed. Margo told us that Annabelle, the wallet's owner, had just left. She apparently said she was going to check the rest of the area of the Grand Market next. So just find someone in the Grand Market named Annabelle. Got the it. Rest, the rest area is where you're going. Not the rest of the area. The rest area. Wait, what is... There's... Oh, like, in the, the awning. Okay. Yeah. It's a little rust area. If you move, God damn it. Fortunately not. She mentioned something about having no choice but to rely on, rely on a... She's gonna go pray to God to find her wallet. <laughs> yeah. For goddess Angus, we will... We, we In her name, we will return your wallet. Yeah. Like all those people are like, oh, you brought this back to me? Oh, God must have sent you. It's like, no. I just thought you would like your thing by back. By the way, the goddess Adios doesn't exist in this world as proved by the people of the church having magical powers. Oh, great. So there's a reason for them to exist. Oh, God. oh, wait, we already met this girl. We met her yesterday. This yeah. is, I totally forgot her name was Annabelle. That's my wallet. Where'd you find it? Well, you see. Yeah. Thank you so much. I'm surprised to hear that a merchant from the gr Grand Market kept it safe for me, however. Kindness remains within people's heart, after all. It would seem. Here. Carlos, I'm very greatly fond of me in any particular amount. Uh, you can take half of what's currently in here if you like. 
Wait, no, I, w I, 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 I want the money. But, but, but why couldn't I have the money? This is bullshit. <laughs> this is bullshit, I hate it.